And three. Why is that zoomed in? Two. One. Hello. I'm uh, just about to open up a B350 Rogue Strix gaming board. Had this in my possession for a day or two now. Still waiting to buy the other parts. I'll give you a quick tour of it. Now this board was, I believe, about £111, I think it came to in total. And this is going to be, well, the parts I'm looking at is a, obviously the board, uh, probably an RX, is it 5, 6, RX, uh, R5-1600. Hopefully paired with a new GPU at some point. At the moment it's going to be paired with my old uh, reliable 970. And of course, hopefully 16 gigs of RAM. Uh, I've not exactly really had much of a look at it this year. Let's see what we've got part-wise in here. Let's have a glance. Cable ties. Very nice. SATA. A bit more SATA. I think it is, yeah. This is kind of cool. Um, oh god, what's this called again? The back plate has uh, foam, which is different. Driver CD, now most people would throw this out saying it's not needed, which it isn't, but on the other hand, if you uh, lose your internet connection, those things are quite handy. User guide, more instructions, a coaster, very novel. Stickers and other crap. So, yeah, this is going to be the basis of my motherboard. Should be quite cool. If I ever actually get the other parts. It's the thing when you're on a budget and you're trying to <laughs> make money stretch, um, sort of have to take it one bit at a time. I will give you a quick tour of the motherboard, as I've not even opened the damn thing up yet. I am currently running an old, uh, well, I say old, but I mean it's it's been a good workhorse from FX8320 with a uh, AM3 Plus Asus. Uh, Oh god, what's it called? What's it called? I can't bloody remember now off the top of my head. Uh, it's a M5 A9C 97, sorry, R2.0 board. As you can see, that's all my crap, which I'm trying to sort through at the moment. Here it is, if I could actually get it out. I don't know how people do vlogging, because I doing this for one hand is kind of difficult. So as you can see, there is the board itself. I'll try not to put the thing. I'm sure someone might shout in the comments about where I've put the motherboard, but eh. I believe it lights up as well. Uh, in fact, I think it does light up. But as I've only had it and I've barely looked at it as of yet, I was going to go MSI. 
Um, and then I saw this at the last minute. And the reviews on this, there ain't that many out there, I must say. Not any from the, the more mainstream sort of YouTubers I tend to watch for this sort of stuff. Let it focus, there you go. Very cool though, looking forward to putting it together. And I will give you a quick glance in the innards of my PC. Uh, once again, don't judge me, cable management is uh, pretty poor, I must say. And I'm running an old Zalman case, which it was a good case for the price at the time. But it's it's falling apart now, it's broken, and I've got to clean it out because there's hairs everywhere. And due to the fact that my parents have dogs, I have to deal with a lot of hair issues. And as you can see, cable management is pretty poor. There's my trusty 970, Cooler Master heatsink, fans, but yeah, it's pretty atrocious to be honest. But it's been a good, reliable, well, reliable board the majority of the time, but i got to clean it out today. And uh, This case was about 50 quid, I think, and air cooling wise, it's pretty good. But like I said, it's, it's, it's getting on a bit now, to say the least. And my setup has changed drastically since, well, console-wise it's changed drastically. Due to the fact that I've only got the PS4, Mega Drive, and my sister's Wii, which we rarely get turned on. Uh, no Xbox One, I sold that. Although, to be honest with you, the PS4 is exactly the same. <laughs> it's just a paperweight most of the time. It's a... Uh, Netflix machine, majority of the time. Corsair keyboard. And other crap that I haven't sorted out yet. Anyway, so yeah, that is my vlog, I guess you could say, of the parts I've got for this new PC so far. More will be on its way. I don't know if I'll do a video assembling it because I ain't actually that good at PC building and usually it takes me a while to assemble these things but uh, when the system is complete I probably do a video just to show the finishing touches of it and stuff I'm looking at a is it a pan, Pandix? I can't even pronounce it, 400 quite a stylish case I think I've seen it for about 60, 70 quid I think on Amazon but shop around as I always will and that's that so thank you for your time